Let's see, one new video. Lying about my weight. I'm so mad at myself. And an earthquake happened. I didn't hear about it, so it must not be that important. I'm sure I'm sure she's experiencing trauma from it though. Like literally PTSD? Hannah Indiana, how's it going? You like Indiana Jones? You're making a video game? Indiana Jones video game? Nobody cares, unfortunately. No, everyone, no one, everyone's like, who gives a shit about Indiana Jones? I certainly don't. <clears throat> She's mad at herself because she ordered food. That's your prediction. So mad at myself. All right, let's watch it. Hey guys, welcome to Hold the new vlog. Hold the up. Shut the fuck up. What is wrong with YouTube lately? <sighs> Sorry. Willow, it's too quiet. The, the, why is the quality so low? Please, please full screen it. Hey guys, welcome to a new vlog. So I know you guys are used to me starting with a weigh-in, but I already did my weigh-in for today. The video is already up. It's the video where I walked oh, tomorrow. Oh, right, right. The same day. See, she's not going to be able to keep up this schedule. The last video, she had content from the day of upload. Yeah, but I just so it's not to looking. Good. There's gonna be a lot really of talking sections. I looked at the comments and you until she gives so up. Amazing! Like, thank you guys so much for the support. Comment like, you guys are so just amazing. as proud of me. I'll that just I am mimic for today. And That's my all mom I got. Is super proud of me. Like, it's just so amazing because during my walk, actually in the middle of it, I sent her a picture because it just looks so pretty out. A picture like, of what? I'm doing my freaking mile because I told her Ice about tea. it a few days ago. How I've been thinking about it, like thinking about doing it. Diet and Coke from I don't Sonic. know. Like I was feeling like I didn't want to fail, and I was afraid that I actually couldn't do it, and I could. But a lot of people are asking. Imagine this me being job, and you can't keep use. the schedule. Even even more so. Why she's the one who makes the schedule? She set it up for herself. She always, she always, she she does these challenges. She decides to do them on her own, sets up these schedules on her own. Map my walk and on like, it. Like, damn, just don't, don't schedule it. So with this app, not sponsored, by the way, <laughs> I sound sponsored because I'm like trying to tell you guys, get it. No, but with this app, um, there's a built-in GPS. She loves acting like she's sponsored GPS, by something, but, though. Um, the only way you can track, like, how far you walk is with the GPS. I know there's those conspiracy theorists who think that I actually didn't do the walk. I saw a comment where someone... Wouldn't a cons wouldn't conspiracy uh, insinuate people conspiring? Who's, conspi who's, who's conspiring? You and Twinkie? Twinkie, we're going to tell them we did a mile, okay? It's like all you did was like swing your phone around don't work that way because it follows the gps and then like when you're done with the walk it shows like the little map part like if she's trying walk. to tell me the app is not a like a pedometer or whatever in, the, could, like, add a picture, the thing that you counts your steps and your notes and i just wrote that me and twinkie had a wonderful time i definitely recommend the app because without it i would have never known how far a mile was and now i know exactly the route i took so i don't even need the um the app next time but i'm gonna want to use the app because i feel like since i did the mile in 52 minutes i feel like i could do it like quicker next time okay yeah the Hello magic guys. of the timer it's yeah january 12th good morning good morning what's today the My 15th body feels wow like it was hit normally people say hit by a semi truck but i feel like it was hit, hit by, by a Mac toy truck. car because i do feel would i feel if i got hit by a toy car that walk from yesterday it's nothing insane but my body like a just... clown car or like a rc feels it if you hear that water dripping it's because we have to lightly have the faucet dripping because it's so cold here so freezing cold. temperatures so uh it's to prevent the pipes from like freezing i guess oh yeah you don't want a fucking repeat of that whole texas thing from a couple of years ago where everyone's pipes pipes burst because i guess they don't have uh insulation around their plumbing right maybe they should fucking get it uh <laughs> i don't know i just got an email about it from the apartment complex so i'm just listening to them this time i would simply in. insulate my plumbing 
stepping on. 509.6 pounds. <gasps> 509.6! <laughs> Freezing Yay! temps. <laughs> we're out of the five tens. Now we're in yeah, the learn single digits. Back, yeah. All right. Five. five. Oh, oh wow. Point. Back here again. Six. I wrote that so sloppy because I was looking at it through the camera. Let's not Illegible. Yesterday was an on track day. So I feel like nice. soon I'm gonna explain to you guys like what does Texans on track owned look by like vegan for me versus off track. I've kind of just Hell been yeah. like prolonging that because I know it's gonna be confusing to a lot of people, but it makes sense in my head. But as of right now, if I can sit here and say yesterday I am proud of yesterday, then that's what makes it an on track day for me. But if I sit here and I go not so proud of the choices I made yesterday, that's what's gonna make me have an. I'm, I'm barely day. following so I'm this. I'm freezing. And I'm about to take Twinkie out. So today we have a turtleneck and I'm going to put on my jacket. So a lot of people oh, got of course. snow and thankfully Don't forget the sunglasses. But the snow is coming. I feel it in my bones. It is so cold out there. Like yesterday when I did my walk, it was just like, I would say it was like 50. I don't, I don't know why. I don't know why I'm getting like a 60 years old vibe today from her now that i've been awake and doing things anyone i took twinkie out earlier just a few hours ago i think like Any, Vietnam, like anyone like, getting my body like uh emily from now uh like gilmore girls I feel good too yay <laughs> so i just wanted to answer this because i've been seeing it like float around um people are saying that my weigh-ins are fake and that there's a lot of editing to them i do edit my videos a lot that's why you guys constantly see like cuts like i literally just did one. oh there, god I, one I, I cannot stand editor lynn oh my god and there 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 it's how i've always edited yeah that only took her fucking half the day i bet my videos and the reason why that like specifically the way each one of those was their own iMovie on your phone project that she exported videos separately. are like that is because there is a lot of dead air I'm sitting there waiting for it to turn on and then in between hello and it's ready there's like five seconds of just like dead air I just take it away all right all I right big lee all right with the announcing how you're going to scale, edit this and how fucking time works to finally read my weight so I just take that out as well um the weigh-ins are 100% authentic take that They're conspiracy real. I don't theorists. know how I can take a weigh-in I know that that's like a hot thing in this section of YouTube is that people think that me and Chantel both fake our way in. Is she ever going to say, if she's ever going to say that name right? I highly doubt she's doing it because she's being blamed for the very same thing I'm doing, which I have never done that. And I never, will. I would love to, I would love to uh, hear Amberlynn try to um, read the name Siobhan. Do that. That's too much. And honestly, that would just be hurting me. And it would be hurting the people who support me and the people who are watching me to see me succeed. Yeah, the only reason why there's tons of cuts is just because that's the way that I edit. I edit every single scene that I film just like that. Honestly, the reason why that I don't show myself when I am, am stepping on the scale is because I weigh myself naked. I feel like once I get to like 490, I will just step on the scale with some clothes on, call it a day, show you guys... Maybe I'll have my mom film it or something. Just okay. Because it's not that I want to like prove myself to people. Turtle likes giving just, Steve it makes me sad that People actually think that I would lie about something as silly as that because if that was the case, I would make myself a lot smaller than in the 500s. I could tell you that right now. I just think it's beyond silly that there's always just this rumor that I'm faking my way in. So Imagine if you didn't bring it up though and everyone stopped because they weren't getting any attention from it. I've never done that, but it's been. Like an ongoing that would thing ruin the whole point. For, That's your whole know, gig right there. Six years, and I'm just like, there's never been a reason that I would ever do that. Like that's wild, y'all. I'm in the dark right now. It does not matter what I look like. But there was just Fru you want to be a frugitarian. <sighs> okay, so I was sitting here and Raw I heard vegan? like a loud noise and an earthquake. It wasn't on the news. So all of a sudden, I felt or maybe shaky. it was. I wasn't like it was like wasn't wobbly, the news. and I was like. I've been watching, um, not watching, but it's on the TV, uh, like the shopping channels, those networks, uh, specifically the jewelry one. And sometimes they have other stuff on like other days or whatever. Amazing stuff. Um, tell you the price is like fucking $12,000. 
and they like sell it for like one tw- like a hundred twenty nine or something at the end. This is like keep going down, and then like the closer it gets to the final price, the more you realize it's it's only just about worth that much. Start selling sh- oh these these bed sheets are five hundred dollars. The whole it's got a comforter, it's got pillowcases, whatever. It's got printed horses on it. We're selling it for twenty nine ninety nine. Okay. This is just a fucking Amazon set of fucking sheets. This is some dropship bullshit. Why did you tell me that five hundred dollars? Am I tripping? <gasps> like, did someone like hit the building and then I was like, oh, Someone hit the building. I'm in Oklahoma. There's a freaking tornado. That is like where my brain went. And but then I was like, but I don't hear a tornado. Like it was all so confusing. She should just go somewhere where there's, she's it's constantly, constantly this tornado problem. It's gonna go but somewhere. But it was an else. earthquake. Doesn't have that. It was that. a four point four magnitude earthquake. It's giving California. <laughs> like I've is been this in a couple for the cats. Um, yeah, I, I haven't like been having in noise since yeah. I lived in California, and that was literally the like when I was eighteen. Plane is and I'm thirty three now. Hit. So. Um, <laughs> wasn't expecting that this winter. Mm. You guys, I have flopped so hard today when it comes to my eating. I have not been on okay. track. And I fought it. Oh boy. Oh boy. Here we go. All day. I purposely, you know, I used to say sitting See, with the discomfort this must, a lot. I'm this sure. must be because she stopped binge drinking. Do you guys remember that? I sat with it hard. Like there were moments you where it fucking was so what? And it just gave me so much anxiety. Like being a food addict is rough. Um, sometimes like oh, remember remember last year when she was about to get weight loss surgery and she said the fucking food addiction never happened, the binge eating disorder never happened. The craving or the urge is so powerful that like if you don't get it, you. You just feel like you're gonna go crazy a little bit. Like you're gonna like go. That's mad. how I guess that's how um, addiction works for me. Like, what are we gonna do when about I do it? Sit with the discomfort. Sometimes it gets really emotional. She did what? Fucking like uh, what about what about rehab? How about some rehab? Look at uh, look at Tammy. I know that I was triggered today massively. I just wanted to numb just myself. Sit with ther- yeah, fuck the um, sit with discomfort. More like sit with a therapist. Yeah. Very much like most. We got Neo. Prime sub. E zero underscore Bahamas just subscribed with Prime. She's Shugufi. Shugufi, thanks so much. Appreciate it. Seven months. Let me see some sandwiches in the chat. She does. My body is telling me what works for me. Personal eating, mm. uh, not having to think about like reality a little bit, not having to think about like. Emotions and sounds a lot like an addiction. And I've been trying to do the what are we doing? And I'm trying to just like distract myself super hard in that way. And it's like, where's the buzz balls to successfully for hours like just deal with like the urges to mess up and just like eat? Did you try a Baja blast? What happened? Zero sugar. I ended up caving and I failed. And that makes me really sad um, because I feel like I'm letting myself down. Where did she even get the shit at that point? <clears throat> Living alone. She just order it? She just, just, just get DoorDash? I feel like I'm letting you guys down, but like I have to be That's a lot of myself, steps. And I know that every single day we aren't going to see a little heart in the corner of my calendar. Buzzball Valentine's not- Q&A. Oh, yeah. Get drunk with me. Single freaking Pringle on Valentine's Day. It'd be amazing. Not realistic at all. It's like I would love to just wake up. Surely she'll have failed by then. Just wake up and be like, I'm never going to make mistakes again. And I'm never going to overeat again. I'm never going to order, never going to order takeout again. But it's just like not realistic. I'm not always going to have a little heart in the corner. It's like seeing so many of them consecutively inspires me and makes me realize that i can't talk about the hearts on the and I know calendar that as long as i have more good days than bad days then that's progress right no not not necessarily in that sense i guess 
I mean, what do they say for like recovering people from like from like addiction? Like you kind of like count your count your sober days, you know, as like a kind of like a your Wait, score or whatever. Like I don't really know. Like, that stuff works. Like the guilt is real. You I could do I... a lot of damage on the on the on the fail days. I don't know. Go back in time and still sit with the discomfort, even though it was super uncomfortable. It, it gets painful almost like i i just don't know how to explain it like you only understand it if you've been through it sounds it like rehab really, needed really, really freaking hard and sometimes i'm strong sometimes i'm powerful i don't know i'm just not not happy with myself right now and i just wanted to like kind of just talk about how i was feeling and my next weigh-in is not going to be cute. I know it's not. Take I was it easy, doing so line. good and I was losing weight almost every weigh-in. And I know that I'm going to weigh-in tomorrow and there's going to be a, a weight gain. We'll and see. And I'm not looking forward to seeing that. But I wonder what she got. What do you think she got? To like do better, be better. And I don't want to let, you know, one night, one slip up ruin, you know, my progress. Okay, you guys. So the rest of this vlog... Oh, it's just a bunch of Lego talk. Now we're talking. Because I know a lot of people don't really care for the Lego bits. So that's why I try to just add like the fact that there's a warning. Oh my God. Pieces of Trigger my Lego, talk Lego talk in each vlog because there's also people who really do enjoy it. But I did talk a lot about um, a couple oh, Legos no. in this video. So oh, I wanted to no. put it all in the end for the people who do enjoy it. So I'm waiting for her to fucking hit us with the like, it's actually like, I love, I'm loving Legos. It's almost like my like special interest or something. I hope that you do enjoy it. It's like my own little I know I thing. <laughs> that, like, so I finished the Lego I was doing. So this is what it looks like here. The back of it looks like that because there's like, it's like my stem. Hang it on the wall, which is pretty neat. I might just put it on my bookshelf. This one Hyper was super easy and on. super fun. I've definitely been using Legos as a distraction. So now I'm gonna go choose the next one I'm gonna do. Okay, it's, that, that one looks phallic, the rocket ship. So now I'm gonna go choose the next one I'm gonna do. <clears throat> I got someone asking where Astro Boy was from. I actually got him from Amazon. It is a little pricey. Damn. Um, He's like $80. I get all of my Legos or knockoff Legos, if you will, from uh -huh. Amazon, but some brands are very pricey, but it was worth I, it because- I, I, you know, I hate to say this is the most interesting shit she's talked about in years, probably. Maybe she should be a Lego channel. Just go all in. Really sturdy. It's nice. It's made well. Okay, guys, so my option is a black car. At least she's a into fucking there, something. Art, or a Polaroid camera. At least there's some exactly fucking depth to I anything. Want. Try to guess. If you said car, you are wrong. I chose modern art. <laughs> it oh, looks so fun. Didn't she already say right, that? Guys, in I am video. about to start my next Lego. Bag one it's complete. A sanity loss bag show. two is complete. Third. Okay, we got the bag frame for the canvas. Okay, so bag four is now complete. Bag five is Is this now Lego brand? Doesn't look like it. There's no way. Completed. Sixth bag is finished. Okay, so bag There'd seven There'd be more is recognizable so pieces if it was Lego. Complete. So now I'm Justice gonna take for the Titanic. Like, whatever happened to that? Can she at least smash it on the ground? And build the art. All right, so here it is. It's fantasy. supposed to be modern art, and it's like a face. Here's the mouth. The, the panty the fantasy. Eyes. But since there was several options of what modern art to make, there's like all these extra pieces. So I think I'm going to use a couple of them. An artist she is. And just kind of edit this. Okay, so I changed a few pieces, and I don't know what it was, but I really wanted to use these guys. So I definitely had to make room for those. Yeah, but these are not Legos. There it is. I could not stop doing this one. Like, I genuinely found this one to be one of the most fun ones that I've done recently. Oh, wow. that's that you it. Guys that's the video. Lego top. Robot bear, modern art, or a Polaroid camera. And oh, I oh, no, it is. What the fuck? It's so weird. I don't recognize any of these pieces. So you think, I think like. I'm use a couple of them. And just kind of they'd edit use this. something. Okay, so I changed a few of pieces, one of the common and pieces. I don't know what it was, but I really wanted to use these guys. 
So I definitely had to pretty cool. Look those, at me. Look at me. There it is. I'm not the Lego I cannot expert. Stop doing this one, like I genuinely You're right, I found yeah, this yeah. one to be one of the most fun ones that I've done recently. I hope that you guys enjoyed my little Lego talk or my vlog. In guess general. I'm the piece the of one. shit. Bye. Cool, cool, cool stuff. Nice. Pookie Lynn is low-key a genius. She can make people forget about her abusive shit with just her one-mile walk. Are we talking about her, her breaking the no contact or... I'm going to talk about this mile walk all year. Let's see mile two. Okay. What do you think she... What do you think she ordered? What do you think she ordered on the, uh, on the, on the fail day? Probably talking about Beck and Casey. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Probably, probably all, probably all of them, right? Those, all that stuff kind of came up recently. I'm going to attempt to start this even though the house is shaking for some reason one video thoughts on beck wow i didn't read the title of this before uh my ex in parentheses week to weigh in and sending nudes vlog noodles she is she did she order ramen uh weird hey guys Weird clickbait. I don't know. This better not be a Q and A. Hey guys, it is January fifteenth. <clears throat> I love the intro for to her videos this year. Remember from my last vlog, I was not on track last night. I was on track the whole day, and then. I Tell this video you say Becky should change back later after people complain. So oh wow. I have a feeling I am going to be gaining weight today, which is unfortunate. But let's step on a scale and today. Find out. Today we're gaining. Hello, it's ready. Okay, stepping on. Five hundred and ten point zero pounds. Five ten point zero. Oh my god, I did not gain as much as I thought I was going to. Hey, so that that's a win. A big relief. <clears throat> the guilt I feel from being off track though definitely motivates me to stay on track today. All right. Whoops. Oh no. That bothers me, but we're going to ignore it. 5 10. Oh my god. Throw the whole thing out. Throw the whole calendar out. You got to start over. Point 0. And yesterday was the off track day. Y'all Actually, it could it could say negative 510. Bro. So and that's a win. Was the off track day. This video is especially gross, is even for her. Oh boy. Oh boy, can't wait. Amazing. It's like literally 10 degrees outside. I just came back in with walking to In Oklahoma. And I swear my fingers are numb. Now I'm about to go out. She ain't going to do well if the pipes explode. We're, me and my mom are going to hang out. We might surprise my grandma and show up there. It's supposed to snow tomorrow. Not looking forward to that. Oh, there was an earthquake Oklahoma. last night. Like, what is happening? I'm not cut out for this type of Thanks, weather. Obama. Like, I want the spring and the fall 24-7. Like, that's what I need in my life, and that's what should spring be Spring and the fall, day. okay. Not icicles and snow. Like, go I'm to a humid climate? I don't know. Okay, so we're about to go into this place called Big Box. It's just like a bunch of Amazon stuff that was never delivered. All right. This is where we're at in capitalism, okay. It's a bin store, let's go look. Icicles. Yeah, Amazon stuff nobody wanted, yeah. That has gotta, that, oh my God. Oh my God, that is so gross. Oh. It don't look right. <laughs> Wait a second. What am I looking at here? What the fuck is this? <laughs> Some dropship controller, okay. What the fuck was that? What, what I you know, like you know those pictures where it's like, hey, try to name one thing in this picture? You can't. Wind rakers? Is it like a wind breaker? Oh, 
This it, it, might as well be a dumpster that they're charging you to pick through. I love drink with you, coffee station. This is so, oh my god. This was overstock fucking dropship from a factory. And they just send the pallets over and take whatever's there. That's crazy. This is garbage. Is this oh my god. What is that? <laughs> <laughs> T par Tea party favor gift boxes. We well we got to buy that. Small parts to keep away from children. Bike. Remember your goal. Keep chugging. Feeling awesome, don't give up, almost finished, you did it. On an opaque bottle? Okay. Keep chug jugging with me, yeah. Um, this is perfect for the buzz balls. Font looks so familiar. Uh, ooh. Ooh, they they squished this one. Look at that. It doesn't fit. Look at the ease. They squished it over here. That's funny. Um, yeah. What is this font? What is this font? Uh, Parappa the rapper. I don't know. I'm not getting out of it. <laughs> no, no, it's too much. You need to drink your water. Oh, it's got that, it it's got that band on it though that you can like. It's like a, it's like a really really long string for emergency purposes. I'm gonna fill it with milk. Is it Fortnite font? Hello. I'm sorry. I'm not getting out of it. No. <laughs> no. Okay, so I didn't get anything, but my mom got this uh, 365 days. Why is there an X the on words it? Words to inspire. For 2022. But it is a 2022 calendar, which is totally fine. That's why there's an X on it, because they couldn't sell it anymore. Hi, Maya. Enjoy your meeting. What's today's? It says your future is bright. Isn't that cute? Okay. That is cute. Okay, but look, still, I love all these positive... You look like a million bucks. Oh, thanks. You should check out Pinterest sometime. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> look, be so Get a Tumblr. Silly, be honest, be kind. I love that. Me too. And like every single one is like art. Yeah. Oh, wait, I'm obsessed. It's adorbs. This is so up Amberlin's alley, unfortunately. That's actually super cute. Do your best. Look, how could you... Keep your enthusiasm. Yeah, that's Keep cute. it up, Amber. This was 75 cents. Today's forecast, 100%. <laughs> Fantastic. Hell yeah. <laughs> so I saw this Icon Cinema and I was like, what is that? Is that where all... Icon? I thought this was a Toon Cinema. It's where all the icons watch movies, literally. Oh, Amberlynn Reed's videos are performed. Get it? Ha ha. Dee Dee's discount. For all Reed's videos are Double performed. D discount. Get it? Ha -ha. Next day. Hey guys, it is the next day, January 14th. I'm sorry yep. that I stopped vlogging yesterday. My mom and I ended up going to my grandma's house, surprising her, visiting her, and then my grandma took me and my mom out. I can't believe she's explaining the rest of her day here. Like, fucking, uh, while I'm looking at the ceiling, this is like when the dentist starts, tries, tries to have a conversation with you. Out to her favorite restaurant. So I was just spending quality time with Holy them. Holy shit. But it is the next day. Let's do the weigh-in. Hello. Hello. Is she going to start flirting with the fucking scale now? Ready. Thank you. Stepping on now. Went to the dentist at the start of the month, and he laughed at me being nervous. Five hundred and nine point Sue him. Six pounds. 
509.6. I was hoping for a bigger loss because I feel like I barely ate anything yesterday, but you know what? I'll take it. 509.6. And yesterday I was on track. I don't. Know, I really. I don't understand what the heart and the set frowny face are doing. That is such a lousy heart. Because I was looking through the camera. I need to not do that. So tomorrow is okay. week two. Weigh in to see how much I officially lost. So this can go, can go like any way. I could do good today and lose more weight, or tonight, which is usually nighttime, where I slip up and do bad. I could do really bad and gain a few pounds overnight and then not lose anything that would suck big on time. martin luther king jr day but i'm hopeful i'm hopeful that you're gonna that gain happen. on martin luther king jr day i don't day. know about you but i normally do not eat things like this I <laughs> okay what do you want a fucking award <laughs> guys please this isn't me please Fucking Vidalia onion patties. I normally always get like turkey burgers, but for some reason, Vidalia, probably pronouncing that wrong. <laughs> I'm trying to think of how she can pronounce that. I guess you could change the accentuation. Vidalia. Vidal, v Vitalia, Vitalia, <laughs> onion beef patties just sounded so good, and I had one last finger. night, absolutely amazing. And I put You're kind some of a fucking sicko. Um, shredded cheese on top, and it melted, and it was delicious. So I'm actually man. Imagine if you vlogged any of that; that would be crazy. I'm about to make one right now. Y'all, I have been Lego obsessed. <laughs> Vidalia is a beautiful name for a little girl. <laughs> I finished the Polaroid. Isn't it so cute? And like you could put these no. pictures in here. I would simply rather have a camera. And they like come out. I don't know. I'm obsessed. By the way, this is a no from me. Okay. Oh my God. Who cares? What? Oh, it was so <laughs> gross. Like, I took one bite and- this, Miss, Miss fucking, I hate meat. I Meat grosses me out. Okay. Pay attention to score. Uh, last time you heard two tattoos, now you're covered. Why are you nervous? And I was like, sir, with all due respect, which is none. I didn't get tattoos in my fucking mouth, did I? Maybe you should have. Uh, and that's, yeah, the tattoos are willingly getting them done. Um, not even my exclamation C-bent worked. Wow. That, what else did I miss? Hi. Okay. Um, C-bent said that when she messaged you on Instagram, she meant it respectfully. Oh, of course. I took it okay, she took it respectfully. Uh... Uh, what did I miss? What did I miss? What does the car say? Some something about something about her DMs are closed. Probably got too many messages from my haters. Like, hey, fucking unblock me or else. She was panting respect. Oh, okay. Anyway, let me know if I missed anything. <laughs> Posted a picture of the Lego bouquet Zach got me for Christmas to put together on my story. Zach responded with OMG expert Legos. Yes. <laughs> uh. Hi, puppy dog. What's the matter? Mom's not hanging out with you anymore. And I hated it. Like, there's this weird layer on the... Is it... <laughs> Did you forget to take the plastic off? Outside, that is just not good. Oh, yeah, that's probably uh, the artificial casing, I'd imagine. 
I got this from 7-Eleven. It was it's to like probably a imitate uh, intestine. I usually like a beef stick. I know that's shocking. <laughs> I, I know, because I'm not a meat girly, but some... You can't... Saying that doesn't make it true. You can't say that and then continue to do it. Because clearly this is your thing. You have a passion for it. Uh, it's It's regular. It's on a regular basis. You know? Some of them are good. This new. So don't get that, folks. But the Lego has been great. I have no more Legos left. I do have... Polaroid land camera as opposed to air? Sea? The Plains of Oblivion? I have two knockoff Legos, so I just ordered... What'd you miss? Um... Nothing really. A couple more Lego brand Legos off of Amazon. Um, they're not like any like huge ones or anything, but they're just like a couple. Land film? As opposed to what? That I've been wanting to do. Mucus membranes? Hello? Next day. How is she getting fucking three days in these? You know the next video is going to be her sitting down and talking for 10 minutes straight. January 15th to fill Monday. up a slot and Mondays are the official weigh-in of how much did I lose that week hello hello okay Monday's the official weigh and everything else is a warm-up okay it's ready okay guys a so scrimmage on 507.4 pounds 507.4 Wow. Yes, I was on track yesterday. Going good so far. Hope she didn't get bored of it. Today, I did really freaking good. Hope she doesn't start going through something that she can't talk about. Oh my god, I'm so happy with this. 507.4. Hell yeah. Seven's my favorite number. You better just stick just, just, just try to stay there then. You don't wanna you don't wanna get off of your lucky number. Besides one. I do like one. Okay. Okay, you guys. So I was five oh. My second favorite 7. number. Point four. That is so amazing. I was on track yesterday. She needs like a support group to talk to this about. So this week. She needs to get. Up, she needs to circle up. Down five point two. I am so so proud of that. And in total, this. Years. Now there's a total loss too. So far, oh my god! Which is only been Fifteen days. Yeah, I really gotta remember something about the number three. That's I'm well. down eight point four pounds, which I'm very happy with that because my goal is to lose a hundred pounds this year. And to reach that goal, I just need to lose one point nine pounds a week. That is it. So I'm already. Yeah, yeah, two pounds a week. Yeah, like way ahead of schedule. I am so proud of this weigh-in. Yay. Okay, guys. So that I went on for to MLK. Instagram. I told you guys to ask me questions. I figured it could be fun to do some rapid fire questions. Oh, okay. And now all of a sudden the title makes sense. I should have known. I should have known that the title meant a Q and A. I, I, I thought about it. I was considering it, and I didn't say it, and I should have said it. So let's get into it. Favorite thing about living in Oklahoma so far? Uh, country music. Definitely living on my own. I love living on my own. My rules. I can do whatever. Square nails are making her sassy. Whatever I want. Everything is mine. It's changing her. It's like my own little like haven, sanctuary. Oh, that's funny because you actually have never wanted that ever. I like doing things on my time. Hey, Mrs. Star. She threw a special number that day. Oh, really? That was the other day? Okay. And I don't know. Just something about it is just so freeing. And I never expected to love it this much, but I really do. Yes. When did you start listening to The Weeknd? So it was 2011. It was on it The was Weeknd? When I heard Same Old Song, I became obsessed with him. There's like a few artists that I am just like majorly obsessed with. Like Banks, Miley Cyrus, Billie Eilish. Whoever, all they have to do is put out a perfume and then she's sold. The Weeknd. And there's a few others. 
And my most recent ex actually surprised me with like a poster. It was so sweet of her because she had a record player and she wanted to put some posters near Take it. Take that fucking and back. She put one of my favorite artists up there. She didn't really care for the weekend like I did, but she did it for me. So she, she surprised me. I thought that was sweet. But the weekend, me and the weekend, we've, we're besties, okay? When's the last time you drank alcohol? I actually have not drank since December besties? 31st because I did drink on New Year's Eve. Dry January. Eve. Why not veganuary, huh? Why not that? I haven't drank since then. When will you be ready for a relationship? Honestly, I don't know because I kind of like the single life. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Of course, there is things that I miss about being in a relationship, but I honestly think it's just like I'm missing those things with my ex. We don't have to get into like detail but there are just like a lot of things detail. that i miss with her specifically what are your thoughts on sending nudes so honestly that is something that um i low-key do but i only do it if i'm really connected with someone we're really into each other i trust them and they have to like ask for it because i'm I, I, sorry but unsolicited no but if you two are vibing <laughs> and they're like hey you want to send i have no like, i have no opinion on this topic sorry <laughs> you have to be really special because i don't just be sending those out to anybody like you have to be a special girly pop okay yeah imagine if they leaked her career oh my god no but i don't see anything wrong with it like that's toxic to think i mean each other go for it did it snow oh that's her fucking vents going i went off. oklahoma yes it did so the last question i'm gonna do is how do you <coughs> sorry i thought about how the how the house is shaking again and now i'm just totally distracted talking about you again so honestly, I find it a little weird only because she was the one who initially said, keep my name out your mouth. This question made me mad now that we know more of Casey's story. Okay, look, I wasn't paying attention to the question. I'm sorry. You have to be a special girly pop, okay? But I don't see anything wrong with it. Like if two people are into each other, go for it. Did it snow in Oklahoma? Yes, it did. So the last question I'm gonna do is, how do you feel about Becky talking about you again? So honestly, I find it a little weird only because she was the one who initially said, keep my name out your mouth. Or the she can't. What are the, what's the, the, the old, the old, the old pot kettle <laughs> saying, uh, fucking last week, fucking last week you started talking about your most recent ex. Uh, out of fucking nowhere and contacting them out of nowhere, even though you agreed not to. So where the fuck are you getting this drive the law is from? Involved. And then I think it was a few months later, I brought up the law just to remind her that that was initially what she wanted. It was my way of... Oh, I don't really know enough of the details of the whole case. Your relationship, Green, to be honest but like now you. she's talking about me. I don't know. Share your story. Share your truth. Share what you think is your truth. I I don't know what else to say about it at this point because I'm just not really into this whole let's talk shit. About and you know what probably help if you start crying right now? I would, I would probably seal the deal. About our ex for money. I I personally am not going to be doing it. I did go against my moral. Oh, oh, moral superiority Lynn over here. Of course. At the time when Destiny started saying all those things about me and I went on live stream and then started doing the same. I was in a very bad headspace at the time, but I'm not gonna let that be an excuse because even if I was in a bad one now, I still wouldn't let myself come to that type of energy because I'm not gonna do it. You can do whatever she wants and I'm not gonna say a damn thing because I just wish her nothing but healing, happiness, health, success. Oh my God, that's so backhanded. But it is a little confusing because she was the one who initially brought up the law. Okay, guys, so I'm the gonna law. The law. These things came <laughs> overnight. <laughs> These are gonna just hit her with the book. To put away, so don't mind that. And I really hurt my finger. This nail almost came off. You guys, it hurt so bad when I was opening these. It boxes. is what it is. Anyways, okay, so I got some slippers. I'll show you guys those out of the package in a minute. Please and I don't. I got some Legos. I did think this one was gonna be bigger, but that's okay. It's New York City. Ba, I got ba, ba, da, 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 da. Why would she get? Why? Why would she get fucking Manhattan? What the fuck? <laughs> okay, sure. Sure. I did think this one was going to be bigger, but that's okay. It's New York City. 911, my ex. I got about some me. roller skates and the newest. I don't like the shoelaces on that. They should have just made it something looser. This one 
which oh bouquet of roses this is the bouquet of roses which if you guys know me you guys know my favorite flower is red roses with baby's breath and that's literally what this is take notes anybody take notes future caretaker take notes so here are the slippers let's see if they fit beck would have loved these slippers they actually fit perfect and they're so cute i'm obsessed so now, now get some nirvana smiley faces I'm and going there you to go add legos to my little collection here god forbid she ever run out of the next legos in line gotta have a stockpile of them not this one though because god I'm forbid about to she'd be alone one. yes i am Y'all, I'm not going to lie to you. The last two days has been so boring. I have been wanting to go outside and walk, but I can't because we are snowed in. I have been able to take... Oh, let's see that snow. Twinkie ...to the uh, dog park, but... Snowed in? Let's see it. That is like literally part of my apartment complex, which I prefer to walk her so we can get like exercise and stuff. But sadly, I have not been able to do that, and I've been really, really itching to do the mile walk without Twinkie. I know the next couple of months is just going to be freezing cold. She does a lot of she does a lot of stating her intentions. It's just a lot of just a lot of what she plans to do, what she would have done if the situation was different. Like I cannot imagine myself walking in 10 degree weather 20 degree weather like it's not gonna happen once it starts getting up like the what would 50s happen? and 60s that's like perfect what's going weather. to happen in 10 degrees in my opinion and i'm just like i need that weather because i want to walk so bad like who is she like i want to go walk a mile you tell me they didn't pay, they didn't they didn't salt the sidewalks they didn't they didn't shovel they didn't plow well, like what but yeah like a lot of people i'm not saying like oh you better go out and do it i'm just like damn you're, you're like you're like wishing that you could enjoy the snow as if there's like a physical barrier like i used to love the snow but now i just feel trapped honestly because like oh my god go the fuck outside oh my god i don't own a single pair of shoes that is like oh I the wrong <laughs> shoes oh my god this is get fucking real ice approved or snow approved so when I do oh walk there, it's god. like, it hurts my feet. Oh my god. It's the just hard snow? to find shoes that like work for uh, me. Was attacked by snow? Anyways, I hope that you guys did enjoy this vlog and I'll see you in my next one. Bye. <laughs> god, I wish I could go outside. Oh, god. I long for the outdoors. It's calling to me. Share what you think is your truth is basically your whole life. No, I don't even think she believes it. I think she just spins a narrative. God, she is so bad at being, like, diplomatic or pretending to be diplomatic. Oh, God. Sealing such a good character in this arc. Torn when's Oh, spring to is tornado season in Oklahoma? Oh, wow, that's going to be fun. Guys, I would love to go for a walk, but like literally, there's gonna be a tornado. Mm -hmm. What did what did Beck say about the law? I don't know. Uh, this is some there was some kind of community tab post a while ago, right? I don't know. <sighs> there's a new Everlyn video after a week. Um, surely there's been some kind of devastating um update. Um, something must have gone horribly wrong because she was doing an upload every other day that included daily weigh-ins and stuff. Sonic, help me! Did you guys hear that? Um, <laughs> so some, something horrible must have happened. It's called, I don't want to admit this. Perfect. Great start. Best snack recipe ever. Great follow-up, and Walmart haul. Oh, my. How about that? Okay. Hey, Deja Lux says, go. So I'm going through something? What she doesn't want to admit is the snack recipe. I don't want to admit this snack recipe. It's actually passed down by my family uh, for generations. So it's actually really wrong of me to share 
<laughs> all right. All right. <laughs> Mom learned it in prison. Oh, boy. Some kind of walking taco. Yeah. Some kind of. You put you put you crunch up the Cheetos and then you put Kool Aid in it and then <laughs> okay. Premium. Hello, January sixteenth. Welcome to a new it's January vlog. 16th. I personally don't. January sixteenth. It's January twenty second. What are you talking about? Cottage and cheese. Yeah. The sixteenth. Time is just like literally flying by. Time keeps on flying, slipping, slipping, why did I slipping. throw butter out the window? I'll give you guys a second. Why did I throw butter out the window? Uh, cause, cause, uh, it's winter and the birds need fats to see butter fly. Oh my God. Damn, what is this Laffy Taffy? What is this, a popsicle stick? <laughs> a pun. Puns she got. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I was going to... Because I wanted to see Butterfly. Literally the stupidest joke ever. Okay, so let's get into this weigh-in. By the way, I was... I love how she's doing her introductions off screen now. Super snacky last night. So snacky. I'm not expecting a, snacky. a loss. So just a, a warning. Hello. Hello. It's ready. Okay, stepping on. 507.0 pounds. Oh, 507.0. I have a loss. As I said last okay. time, it's like it's like I'll you're at the out. dentist's office and they're trying to have a conversation with you. Chewing in the background. Twinkie's eating her breakfast. I hear I Twinkie shipping in the background. Zero, which I'm so happy about. Hey, this is a perfect snacky example night be damned. Yesterday was a gray area because it's like I told myself several times to stop snacking. And What's the bad times, news then? Hey, we got like myself. six days to make up for. There's plenty of time for something to go horribly wrong. But there was a couple times where Hot I take. Like, she should actually just gain weight. One more. Some, may, some may say, some may say. I have thought of making my gray area like a cloud, like a little cloud because clouds gray are gray. area. Oh my well, God. Sometimes they are, but maybe I'll start that in February. So I'm just going to put that I had an off day yesterday, even though I don't fully believe that. Fully? I was a little snacky. I gave in a little. I was eating food? Here and there, but it was nothing like crazy or intense. This is the newest um, upload like less than an hour ago. Like stay the same or gain a couple ounces. So maybe it wasn't ounces. So I'm currently the decimal the does not equal ounces. I hope she I'm knows. I'm doing my laundry and you guys carrying my laundry in this. It gets really heavy, especially when it's wet. So I put it on top of my suitcase. Literally game changer. You can put it in the suitcase. How is she not asking them to just take the fucking washer and dryer and put it in her apartment? Dr. Lynn Metis woman has gone. I'm currently just waiting. The fingers. My, I thought my clothes were done drying, but they still had 15 minutes, so I'm going to wait a good, like, 10. And then... You all right? I've been crying? I'll be done. But I just wanted to show you that life hack if you have to go into a different unit to, you know, do... As one would. ...clothes, or if you have to go to, like, a laundry room that's, like, in your apartment complex. Put that shit on if, top if of If you could be so lucky. Suitcase. So here it is, and... I would just get a thing that's meant to fucking carry laundry. And I just push it. It's literally the best invention, I know. Wear and tear on that suitcase, though. Okay, you guys, so it is the next day. Um, my Where's she going, anyway? Mom's pipes actually froze. So she had to come Classic. over here. Shower. Classic South moment. It's the middle of the day. I haven't even done my weigh-in yet. I've been awake for literally hours and hours and hours now. You should let her just shower in the empty apartment. So she could, she, why don't you just have your mom just take over the empty apartment? I mean, like, I why not? I myself in the middle of the day because your weight fluctuates hardcore, especially after you've ate. It is what it is, but let's go do the weigh-in. Okay. Okay, so just for continuity, I'm going to say the date, January 17th. I can't believe I've weighed in 
daily for 17 days. Like, that's crazy. Hello. Who asked you to? It's ready. All right, stepping on. 508.8 pounds. 508.8? Oh. <laughs> Your girl Oops. is not surprised with Oops. that. Okay, so 508.8. Makes Oops. me very sad to see it, but yesterday I was not on track. So mm. that explains that, that explains it plus weighing myself at such a weird time of day but no excuses i still have not oh, god if only it wasn't the different I have time some of day news they fixed my dryer a guy came today and fixed it there was like a massive indent on the outside so when this would be running it would sound crazy so he fixed it i'm so happy i get to finally oh my god they couldn't have done that a month ago do my clothes in my apartment Okay, you guys, so I surprised my mom with a little something something. So if you remember this clip from my last vlog or a couple of vlogs oh, ago, Amazon. my mom got this uh, 365 Days of Words to Inspire. <laughs> but it is a 2022 calendar, which is totally fine. Well, I got her the actual 2024 one, and I know she's oh, going to be wow. so happy and excited she, for it. So I think she was completely fine with the 2022 one. I'm excited to give it now to her. Now you're giving her two things to do a day. Okay, you guys, so I have started the Roses Lego. Mm -hmm. As you can see here, I've already made eight roses. But as you guys know, Lego is super expensive. Oh, and it's a hobby that delivered. I've been doing a lot of lately. I've been doing it for literally years. The Lego time. I've just become kind of fixated on it again. Pikachu! So, something else. <laughs> oh, Amberlynn getting into Pal World. Am I right? Am I right? That I really enjoy doing. Is that diamond is painting diamond or whatever? Paint. Yep, there we go. So, I actually got this from Amazon. I do like Pokemon. Oh, yeah, name three. Name every Pokemon on that right now. The thing. I think they're adorable. So I got this Pokemon diamond painting. Name top left. And I'm excited go ahead. to give it a go. And Name bottom no, left. No, diamond painting is not as fun as Legos, but it's definitely a cheaper hobby. Very frugal, very frugal. Oh, okay. And that's Hello, that. it's January That 18th. was that day. Hello. It's ready. It's out for delivery still. Stepping on. Ratatouille. I had some Ratatouille well, last night. Point. 512.2. Oops. Oopsie. Oh, God. I could cry, but I'm not going to. This, when she posted this like um, an hour ago. actually breaks my heart. So it's going to be a sad face day, I think. was the worst day food-wise. Imagine it was a heart. I was actually on track. January. What you guys are Jen! So true. I would love that. I would love to do anything else. Scene is a <laughs> lot of bitch. hot Cheeto and Reese's, a lot of salt, a lot of salt, ramen, just like literally. Yesterday was so bad. I just, I can't even put it into terms. It just truly felt like I could not get full. Physically, mentally, emotionally, like it doesn't matter. Okay, well, everything after physical, I feel like is a different problem. That's that's clearly just filling a void. Put a handmade garland, made, put up a handmade garland five minutes ago, cat already destroyed it. And so the cats be cat and I gain weight so easy. The sodium is no joke. Ah, this if only it wasn't there's ah, if only I could quit salt. It's all the salt I had five pounds of salt. I just can't get away from it. You guys, it's just and normally salt. situations like this would make me cry, but it's like, why am I gonna cry when I did this to myself? Like I literally did this to myself. No one did this to me. What an odd no take. No one did this for me. This is my fault. So I did that. Crying, I did that. I'm gonna use this as motivation to do better. We can't. We can't let days like this happen. Like these used to happen way too often. Why, was this a board meeting? What's going on? And, oh. Hey guys, so it's January 19th. 
So I feel like that was a quick cutoff. Hey, Sakura, how you doing? Way in here. Hello, it's ready. So I'm about to step on, but I do want to say I did better yesterday than the day prior. So let's keep our fingers crossed. Okay. 512.4. Boo! I was expecting like this to fucking lose a scale. Bit more than that. Stupid so. scale. I somehow this is Beck's fault. I know it. I know it. She tampered with something. Off track yesterday. Like, all of these off tracks are definitely a reflection of my mental health. That's something I've definitely noticed. Okay, and guys, what's the I next really step for, for that? This, what are we doing but, about that? Uh, admitting that I am currently depressed for some reason is hard for me. There's just so much stigma around it, and I just... Stigma fucking balls in your mouth. Oh! And I don't know why. Like... I have no reason. Sorry, to sorry. Depressed. Anyway, go on. Other than mental illness, like I have been like denying it. My I bad. Have been in denial, and I've just. She set herself up days. so well. Just that feeling of it coming, and today it just like really hit me, and I just haven't wanted to get out of bed. The only thing that I am oh, finding the strength to do is literally get out of bed and take Twinkie outside. Days like okay. this used to happen. Well, at to least me you got that. At a lot, very frequently. Like my emotions used to be very back and forth, up and down. It was like I was either depressed or manic. There was never like an in-between. And it's like lately, just over time, especially within the Jeez, time of living on my get diagnosed own, with I have ligma, found yeah. some sort of balance. So for me to feel this way and to feel as low as I do, I just feel really sad. And it's like... I feel like a failure right I, she's, now. She's got to do and something about this. I have this. missed uploading days because of this. And it's like the only thing I could do is ride the wave. Um, this has been my life for my whole life. And I just have to ride the wave. The thing is, like, sometimes the wave, it lasts months, weeks, and sometimes just a couple of days. I just want to be okay. Sometimes and I you gotta hop okay. on the gravy train. And today's just not, just not it for me. Like, if you would have asked me four days ago, Amberly, how are you doing? I would have said, I'm great. I'm happy. I'm good. And today I'm like, miserable beyond belief okay. and i just feel eh. so sad like Made within my soul FedEx truck. but i know it's because i'm depressed and that's just how i am feeling right now so okay. if anyone else is struggling with depression just know i know how it feels and you're not alone and we're gonna get through it thanks hello hello it's, it's like a group vlog. effort it is january 20th so i am feeling a tiny bit Do you guys like my I shirt with little Coke Zeros on it? Where I talk to you guys just very surface level about like, I feel a tad bit depressed. Yesterday was really, really bad, but thankfully okay. I feel like I have dug myself on out of track. my depression hole a little bit. And if you are a cardinal sign, aka Capricorn like I am, you guys know that January 20th, it's a good day today. Because Pluto has finally left Capricorn. I used to not really be into like zodiac signs, but I don't know what it is. Like, okay. especially within like the last like month or two, I have been more fascinated with it. So I have just been like doing research got, you need to and like latch on to something, it. right? And I don't know, kind of. Sorry, like guys. <laughs> I'm having a really bad day. Uh, Mercury's in retrograde, and it's just okay. Anyways, the I'm salt, right the sodium, the sodium when it's in retrograde is just really okay. bad. Stepping on five hundred and thirteen point eight pounds. Five thirteen point eight. I've had five two liters of eating, zero sugar root beer past two weeks, which is very freaking sad. Nice. Oh my god reasonable okay, you guys so this makes me really sad to even have to sodium is back in capricorn but the sodium based planets are in alignment i'm not doing that great with my mental health and that reflects okay. all right the way that i eat that is very prominent like i am so glad i started documenting all this down my depression goes away when i see I the vegetables get a little shower at the grocery store that is a fun that myself that, that is a fun thing to experience it's like rainforest cafe <laughs> every once in a while they have the fucking big storm that was scary 
right? When my mental health is really bad, so is my eating. So I'm gonna try my very okay. hardest today, especially to just focus on the good things in today my life. Today we're trying, everybody. I have so much to be grateful for. Today's and I the just, day I really need to that we that we take back our figure lives. Figure this out. All these little sad faces. Okay. I would try. I would try drawing a smiley hey guys, face. It is the next personally. day. I didn't even do my weigh in today. My mom ended up staying the night last night, and we watched. A scary movie called Thanksgiving. Scary movie. She must have it's been like devastated to not be able to drink any buzz balls last night. Killer movie. And I could guess who the killer was like almost immediately, but I still actually enjoyed it. Anyway, so I guess. Okay, well, that's good because this, the whole point is not to just not know night, the ending. And you can still enjoy like, things. This weird mental headspace I've been in and the fact that I've been flopping anyways on my weight like i just like didn't weigh myself i didn't even think about it until just now being in the car so i do apologize about that um me and my mom are actually heading to my grandma's house and we're gonna play some cards today um it is sunday by the way um sunday january 21st i think it's I do gotta be it must be saying the dates of my videos like I don't know if I'm gonna continue the daily weigh-ins. I don't. I don't know. I just. Like, oh, just see, like, okay. Now, now after she went about four days of not uploading, I think we all came to the conclusion that uh, this this uh, current program is gonna end. Right. As soon as she stopped uploading every other day, doing the daily weigh-ins and stuff, it was like, oh, this is. This video is going to be the end of this, right? That space ever, and I don't really know what's happening, but honestly, I think it might be seasonal depression, which is not fully something that I've ever- Valentine's Day right around the corner, line up those buzz balls. I've struggled with before, I've just struggled with straight up Seems like it's about to end, Skoro. Due to me being bipolar, but I've never like experienced like seasonal depression, but I just noticed like just being trapped indoors, like I'm not indoors right now, but like- is it possible that your actual real depression is just, you know, sneaking back in like a wave? You said like that, right? Because that comes that comes around once in a while, right? The highs and lows. I don't. I'm not really familiar with that at all. There works. was a lot of ice and a lot of snow, like especially last week and stuff. And I think just like the cold is getting to me. As, as opposed to what going to the beach, Amberlyn. As opposed to what. Going to the park, hitting up a flea market. Really know what it is. Um, genuinely, I Farmers don't have market. to be sad about. Like, there's so many things that I'm grateful for in my life and happy about. And I don't know. Depression doesn't. There's. It's like uh, in the in the. Uh, I'm uploading a video later today, uh, and in that, uh, it's a, one of the Wood Delbers, and in that, uh, it was after she got. A spoiler, sorry, uh, for the upload later. It was after she got a tooth pulled uh, that was bothering her for 11 years. And uh, she was eating a strawberry cheesecake, like, jello pudding pack. And she was like, God, I, I just want, all I want right now is a carrot. I wish I could just snap into a carrot, but I have to eat soft foods. And she had the strawberry cheesecake cup. Doesn't have to be a reason. It's a. Now she's like, God, I just, I wish I could get outside. I wish it wasn't all snowy and icy. I will say that um, a couple days ago was definitely the worst, but I am feeling better. So, yay. Guys, I am genuinely feeling a million times better. Like, I just had a. Now, see, that's concerningly fast turnaround. I don't know about that. Hard last like five days, six days. I don't know. But I feel so much freaking better i actually just posted no a couple kidding. of tiktoks and one of them i do edit <laughs> yes. tammy slayton Woo. and we're both dancing <laughs> i don't like how it looks like she chose she chose happiness today i don't know it's just there i still have my uh balloons they're alive and well folks they're hanging in there oh my god i have a haul i just remembered i bought my first hey, squishmallow food? ever okay oh dear you remember in a recent, <laughs> recent when Dalber I asked, uh, what's her next um, obsession going to be for 2024? Let me grab it. You guys are currently sitting on the bed. About to drop 10K on something. Look! 
strawberry Isn't milk. The cutest thing. I promise I'm not gonna get a squishmallow addiction. It's just <laughs> she was so cute and she was calling out to me because me and my mom were at Walmart yesterday and also got a few other things. So let me haul that for you guys. Haul so it? Do you mean show us? Oh my god! So I got two. Fake plants. <laughs> I do like fake plants. Yeah. I just thought these were super adorable. What happened to all the other fake plants she's got? How many fucking different fake plants can you buy? What happened to the other ones? <laughs> How are squishmallows? Transphobic. Supports Israel too. Oh my god. Squishmallows. Oh my god. That cute exterior. You never would have known. Oh. I love the burn them. Little burn piece. them now. I don't know what you call those. And then I also got this adorable Barbie mug. I was like, um, yes. I love Barbie aesthetic. I don't even think if I like If only the they could make a Pal either. World like, version of Squishmallows. I don't know. Two of my lights have gone out in my kitchen. Uh, this guy, I think there's like three lights in that, and only one is currently working. So we got. Oh my god. Beck, where's Beck? I know this is her fault. Somehow this is Becky's fault. Those figured out. So these are glass. They're room and linen spray and salted coconut and mahogany. Okay. Look, fucking, oh my God. Look at this. Look at the fucking cat food. God damn. I know we're still doing this. Oh, <laughs> why is there so much fucking food? God damn it. <laughs> she fills this shit up like once a week. I'm sure of it, right? She just fucking just leaves the food there for like a fucking week and just lets the cats just come around. <laughs> they got it. Oh, is it normal? I don't know. Well, when when we were giving the cats dry food, we like you know, give them wet food and there's and then some dry food also on the side, and by the end of the day, we we dump the dry food they didn't eat because like if you look at the pieces of the dry food that have been out all day compared to ones that are still in the container, they've clearly like dried out and gotten old, so. And, and I know she buys the fucking, like, 40-pound bag of cat food, too. And it's probably not going through it that quick. <laughs> I know I'm, I'm, so I, I, I know I'm really critical about stuff like this. Living room. So I love when my apartment smells good. So I also got some more wax melts because I love them. They're both Yankee Candle. I got Moonlit Cave. Maybe I'm too Lux critical about it. Cashmere. But... So that is my little haulage. Okay, guys. So I wanted to wait to try this, but I need to it's just, it, It's like, sh there's, there's, there's ways that that could be like, ma like maybe, uh, maybe we're seeing it wrong. You know, maybe it's a smaller bowl than we thought. Maybe like, you know, maybe they do go through it and then she takes it and cleans it and fresh, like refreshes it and whatever. But just based on like her habits and just like the way things seem from this perspective, uh, it's like, I don't know, is she really like emptying that thing out once in a while and cleaning it? Uh, is the is the bag of cat food really properly stored that it's not just like sitting there aging, you know? Like. Now, um, my friend did it, okay? And. Like, sure, there's, there's, there, there's conceptually a way that like, I'm seeing it wrong. I was like, like maybe she just does that okay. every day for them. I need to try this for a vlog. This lighting though is not cute. So I'm it gonna take It just doesn't seem cream. like it. Yes, I am. I'm gonna hey, open it. Cat food's better. Gonna, and what I'm gonna a do good is crunch. I'm gonna drink it. Okay. Just kidding. I'm gonna come in here. Yeah, there is also video evidence of her just topping off the bowl, right? Restaurant From previous style years. Dressing ranch. I'm gonna open her up. I'm gonna add her into the sour cream. I have no idea how much. So and at the end of the day, like, are is, are 
don't Rarity and wasabi physically <laughs> ill at any yeah. of this? No. Ew. So now I'm going to sit oh, we're making stir dip? this. Sorry, I cut it off on the whole thing. For probably a hot minute. All right, so I stirred it, and it looks like a dip. So she took some of these, like, sweet <laughs> mini bell pepper thingies. And if you guys know me, you know that I love these so much. Your cat's like she does. So, so right. So I was like, I got to try this. She just dipped it. You put <laughs> fucking peppers in, what is that, like, sour cream and onion dip? She said it was really good, so. What am I missing? What, isn't this, isn't this just a, like fucking vegetables in ranch or whatever? Here we go. Like. Oh, is it Greek yogurt? Oh. Oh, no, you can, if it's unsweetened Greek yogurt, I hear it's a good replacement for uh, sour cream at times. What? Holy. No, it's sour cream. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's my new favorite snack. Wow, that's great. <laughs> What's the, I don't understand. Sour cream and a ranch pack? Oh. Okay. It's it's vegetables and dressing. I don't know. What <laughs> what is the hack here? Isn't this what they like recommend you do with the flavoring packet? Have you ever ate something so good you just have to like close your eyes for a minute? Does that mean that we're that we're, she's on an edible right now? <laughs> okay, guys. So I just sat here and edited this whole vlog. Originally, I mean, I do, I do get that. I do get that at times. Sometimes I do need to close my eyes for a minute. If it's like two hours after an edible and it's like some. Some kind of like cookies and ice cream or something. Minutes and somehow I got it down. What? Okay, guys. So I just sat. What the fuck is wrong with her today? Here and edited this whole vlog. You good? Originally, it was almost forty minutes and somehow forty minutes of raw footage. Okay. Oh, I got it down like half that time. Okay. Okay. Yes, as one would to edit. Yes. That's pretty amazing. But I'm sorry. How lucky for you the content that you make that only half of it is not going into the actual finished this thing. This video is up way past when it should be. <laughs> I was supposed to be uploading every other day and I have flopped. I mean, don't don't get me wrong. Mine I'm cutting like fucking like 2 minutes off. When I'm doing my stuff, because I, I I only record when I'm ready. You know? But I am feeling better now. Um, mental illness is just as important as getting the flu. Sometimes you just need a break, and I'm feeling a lot better. Um, anyway, <laughs> so that's the very wise words. Mental illness is like the flu. Sometimes you need a break. I hope that you guys did enjoy this video, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. So very, very simply put. Very simply put. Handy Chef infomercial. Okay, there's not going to be a good comments because this is brand new. Vegetables dipped in ranch. What a revelation. Her voice morphs into who she hangs with. We all know that. Ceiling is doing well. Nice, nice, good. Good, good video. Hopefully we start getting the regular uploads again, right?